Hi, everybody. Good afternoon, Europe, and good morning, America. My name is Alina, and today I would like to talk to you about how Empalis, our company, evolved to a managed service provider, which role plays Predata in this process, and all the benefits you may have as a potential partner or customer. It is also a story about challenges, business model transformation in times of digital transformation, how to become more agile, cover your risk, and scale up your business. But first of all, let me tell you a little bit more about Impalis, who we are and what we did. Impalis is already 30 years old. We are situated in Germany and do IT infrastructure projects, meanwhile, in the whole DAC area. This is Germany, Austria, and Switzerland. And our major focus is on data protection, especially around IBM Spectrum Protect and Spectrum Protect Plus. We cover everything here you can imagine within data protection, starting with architecture design up to implementation like installation configuration, migrations from older versions to newer ones, or from other backup solutions to Spectrum Protect. We do health checks and reviews of the existing infrastructure to improve not only the backup quality, but also to optimize the performance. We work very, very close with IBM, participating at beta tests, feedbacking on further possible features and enhancements, acting actually as influencer in, a, in, in, in the development of these products. And we are also invited regularly by IBM to participate as authors at the around the Spectrum Protect product. So technically speaking, we go really deep down into IBM Spectrum Protect. Our people have achieved basically all certifications levels possible within the IBM certification structure. And even one more, some of our people were even granted the grandfather status within IBM Protect. And I do not mean they are having grandchildren. Some of them are indeed quite young, so for that. What I mean is IBM chooses and invites around 11 people each year that are well known within IBM as highly skilled Spectrum Protect guys to write, test, and verify all other certification questions. And each year, two between, between two, sorry, and five of these people um, worldwide are employed in our company. And on top, we hold around 98% of all Spectrum Protect trainings and workshops in Germany. And some of these trainings are even designed and written by us. So this was the situation up to a few years ago. At that time, we had some tough challenges actually to manage. Our people were bound in the project full time, on site. There was no chance to scale their resources and time except by hiring further people for new projects, which is okay when the economical situation is good. But in times of economic crisis like 9-11, if you remember, or after 9-11, the risk of unemployment grows in each enterprise. Customers are not investing anymore in new and modern projects. They rather try to save money for, by, by firing people and assigning the remaining people even more tasks. So that the result is, at the end, that everybody is unhappy. Customer employees are completely work overloaded. Their infrastructure is outdated. And as workloads and data tend to grow each year, independent of the crisis, the performance of quality uh, of the backups are getting worse each day. So the being a top dish, you can imagine. Less sales, barely any revenue, and definitely not a stable situation. Another challenging aspect is finding the data protection experts on the market. The best ones were already part of our team. Hire younger people and build them up to experts was in good times due to the tight time plan in running projects not possible. In bad times, we would have had the time to educate, which we use actually to educate uh, anyway, our existing team. But obviously, we were not able to hire more people 
at that point. And we're rather busy uh, by saving our own people and business. So until some years ago, we were definitely missing something. And at that time, we said managed service component could be the solution for all our challenges. So we started around four years ago developing a concept for our call today and parallel service plus. And this was the point actually in time we also met the predator team. At that time, we were studying the chances on the market, looking at some of the other managed service providers and also comparing the tools that support such a service. And I did not want to reinvent the wheel, to be honest, um, but make it better and different than the others and put in there our own value add. So I still don't know today if it was just coincidence or some divine providence, but um, when Alistair, the CIO of um, CEO of Predator contacted me at that time saying, I have the solution that you need, Alina. You can imagine, I was quite skeptical at the beginning, thinking uh, another guy trying to sell us something. But still, some of his arguments caught my attention. And therefore, I started the discussions with him and our team, with, with his team. And we, we realized quite too soon that um, this is it. That will help us build a managed service by Empalis. One that gives us deep analytics insights into the backup environment of our customers, that supports us to manage their data protection environment and indirectly master all those challenges I mentioned earlier. So, we started a partnership that goes beyond just buying a product from another company. Our technical team has, has since then worked very, very close with the Predator team, participating at the continuous development uh, in Predator, uh, in on-site meetings, with brainstorming, with design thinking workshops regularly, meanwhile virtually, of course, and all this around the possible and missing or, or missing features in Predator, or just finding out what is the best way for Empalis to, to carry on. Predator, on the other side, was becoming more agile in their development um, through our support, enhancing their product for all of us, so that at the end, it was a give and take on both sides, and everybody profited out of it, all partners, all Apex partners. So that, that's why I would say it's probably a reason why we are today an Apex partner. So Predator is providing us and you out there as customers and further customers um, today with all analytics, monitoring, ticketing, alarming functionalities needed to get a deep insight into one's backup environment. Through the recovery orchestration, you can even test the quality of those backups. So technically speaking, if, if you like, like us, use or plan to use modern data protection methods like containerization, deduplication, automatization, cloud replication and cloud functionality, or uh, backup as a service, for example, whatever. All this is supported by Predator platform or will be supported in the future still. So the idea is that you can concentrate on implementing and using these methods without bothering too much about the management level beyond it. And on top, Predator brings up a multi-tenant pay-per-use billing, which allows us and our customers to break down the cost and invoice these costs further and, and put some additional costs and services costs on top and invoice all this further to their own customers. And this particularly, and the fact that Predator, meanwhile, evolved to a global management software platform were mandatory features that we definitely needed for our customers. And maybe at this point, um, you should know that our customers are mostly IT providers offering data protection services themselves, either to some internal departments or to their customers worldwide. So from this point of view, um, we and also our customers need to be able to act and manage globally. And Predator supports that aspect too. 
finally, I would like to mention the benefits you have from this business. And are you a customer or a potential customer for managed service? Then you should know that Predator and our Empire Service Plus are both very modular. You can choose between different service level agreements from easy monitoring reporting up to a 24 by 7 full managed environment. And you are able to change between those levels flexibly, and you can also act on a local or a global way. As I said, our service is done by highly qualified staff. You can only profit from it. Save yourself a lot of money and eventually trouble, because we solve your problems before they even get to your problem. And this leaves you, on the other side, a lot of time to concentrate on other topics and eventually more interesting activities. You get, by the way, the highest level of payment flexibility based on a per paper use and software as a service model. And changing from a KPEX to an OPEX model could be very interesting, actually, for your financial department. If you contribute to your company's eventual cash preservation plan. So if you are acting globally, we are prepared for that by using Predator's global management software platform. That way, you, if you have a preferred managed service provider in one or the other country that is also an Apex partner of Predator, we can all use the same platform. And you can measure our success the same way to all countries. Now, are you a partner or a potential partner for managed service? Then I would like to tell you what, what we experienced, because we have evolved, meanwhile, to a full managed service provider, 24 by 7, able to act globally and supporting our customers to act themselves globally. Our business, in terms of revenue and staff, grew since then around 30% due to this development. We have built, through our managed service, also a full trust relationship to our customers with quite some nice side effects, like sometimes we build even specially for the customer designed appliances or sell just more hardware like tape libraries, which were never actually our focus. But we ourselves benefit also from, from this whole partnership, and especially from the payment flexibility, the paper use and software as a service models too as we have a constant revenue through the year, reducing any risk in times of economic crisis. And by using Predator with all its modules, this is what I mentioned before, analytics and monitoring and reporting, ticketing, alarming, billing, recovery organization, cloud functionality, we perform way faster in our service, save a lot of time, and time is money, and we can concentrate more on the customer challenges within their data protection environment. And as I said, as an Apex partner, we can use Predator's management software platform globally. And additionally, we participate very, very actively at Predator's HI development process, planning and designing the future direction. Now, if you think that the consulting revenue died, no, it didn't. It just changed a bit. As every managed service project includes at the beginning and eventually through its contractual time, depending on the SLRs, of course, um, that you have, some consulting budget. For example, to improve or to migrate the customer's environment into our managed service or, or to move the customer to containerization and duplication. Now, our own digital transformation from a 100% pure consulting business to also a managed service provider has tremendous positive aspects in the development of our company, making our revenue more stable, more reliable, less risk in economic crisis times. And the next one is unfortunately all around us already with the pandemic. And maybe just to give you an idea, the the, um, at the moment, we have a good and stable balance around 50 to 50, 50% 50, uh, 50 revenue from consulting and 50% revenue from services. 
And even if those two business models are different between consulting and service, we experience a very positive aspect related to our people's skills shift as they rotate between the two operating models. That way, gaining even more experience for their vita. And generally, they've become more digital in their work. A lot of tasks done otherwise manually are now through the usage of Predator, not necessary anymore or automatically done. So that here we've been also been able to scale our time and scale the resources that we have. Yeah, and by the way, I was talking earlier about the fact that in Germany, it is not easy to find the highly skilled people in data protection domain uh, we are keen to have on board. And, um, and that due, due to a tight um, timetable in consulting, we have not managed to build up people either. Now, managed service in return opened another side effect, a nice one. We suddenly had a bit more time left without losing our revenue. And this time we started to use for building up our own experts. Some apprenticeship models were now getting very attractive. One, one of them is maybe nice to mention as we even did a generation change or generation transfer uh, father to son <laughs> in our company. One of our experts, actually one of, one of those IBM grandfathers retired recently. And short before his retirement, uh, we hired his son, who already had IT skills and experience based in service, but absolutely no skills in data protection. And meanwhile, he has also become one of our experts. So summarizing all this, I can say changing a business is, or a business model, is surely a risky step. But with the right focus, consistent pursuit of your goals, the right partner, and especially the right team behind you, everything is possible. To stick with the words of the Chinese philosopher, change, be afraid of standing still. So whatever your plans are for the future, independent of whether you are a customer, potential customer, partner or potential partner, Apex or not, or if you just want to be a part of a cool team that is very, very close to development and implementation of modern technology. If you want to call for a change, then join us, be a part of us, be a part of the world pack.